In this lesson, we'll be discussing step number five. Uh, without wasting your time, let us read the instructions and try to implement what it requires from us. Okay. Step number five reads as follows. At the beginning of the paragraph below the title, insert the picture downloaded with your grader files. Okay, the name of the uh, file is word underscore 1g underscore uh, underscore swim underscore as dot jpg. Okay, then after doing that, okay, let's not let's not implement the second part. Let's just implement this one here. I'm just gonna highlight what we are doing now. Okay, so let's go to our file. They said they told us that okay at the beginning. So click on this here to move the cursor or the pointer to this to the beginning of this particular paragraph. Okay, uh, the instruction said at the beginning of the paragraph below the title. So this is the title. This is the paragraph that they referred us to. Okay, so we need to insert an image here. I'm gonna insert an image just now. Click on insert. Okay, and then you'll get options here. Select for pi select pictures. I mean, okay, uh, select pictures. No, we don't want that. We want uh, okay. The picture go to your folder. Oh, okay, uh, and then this is the picture that we are looking for, and then insert this one. Okay, so after inserting the file, what are we supposed to do next? Uh, to find out, we need to go back to the instructions file. Okay, it says that we need to change the picture height to 1.7 and the layout options to square. Okay, let me let let us do one thing at a time. I uh, change the picture height to 1.7. This is 1.7 inches, not centimeters. Be careful. Okay, so let's highlight that, and then we go back to our document. Okay, we need to change this. Uh, click on the image. If you click on the image, you'll see the format option here will be selected. Uh, under this tab here, you'll get these options and add, like in your far right, you'll uh, top right corner, you'll get the height option, okay? Just reduce this one to one point, or you can just type 1.75, okay? Let's just type 1.75 inches. It's important to remember it's inches not centimeters then after this what are we supposed to do next let's go back to the instructions file okay uh, we are here now so it tells us oh not not this one we want the instructions file okay we have done this and then now it says we need to change the layout options to square okay layout options go back to your file uh, click on your file to change the layout options, you need to click on this thing here. And then you need to hover your mouse or your cursor on this item until you find the one that's written square. Okay, this is the square one. Click on it. Okay, then after clicking on this one, go back to your instructions. Okay, they told us we need to do this. We've already done this. And then we highlight, we highlight that we have actually executed that instruction. Okay, uh, now it tells us that we need to format the picture with a 10 point soft, uh, soft edges effect. Okay, let's go back to our document. Uh, okay, the image is still selected. We need to what to format. Okay, we need to include effects. Okay, so to get your effects, you need to oh, come to this option here. This is picture effects. Uh, click on the drop down button. Okay, it will give you options. We're looking for soft edges. Then you, uh, under soft edges, you search for your 10 points. Okay, then you click on it. Now you've implemented uh, that instruction. Let's go back and see if there's anything left. No, there is nothing left. So we're basically done with uh, step number five. Okay, uh, please watch the next video to see how to do step number six. Okay.